Alright, welcome. This is Mario Adventureland, a demo. This is by, uh... Enui? Goldfeld? This is five exits. Normal difficulty. This is a demo to a ROM hack that I'm working on. I would like feedback on improving levels for the future. Alright, well, let's give it a go. And see if we can't give some some criticisms, some some commendations. Bowser has stolen the princess and fled to the land of somewhere. It's up to the Mario Brothers to stop him once more. Alright. Five levels. Rigid Mountain Base. He's an Xbox One controller. Custom music? I don't know what game that's from. If it is from a game. It's gotta be. That's not Mario. So we got Goombas. Music is good. It fits. We got some Koopa Troopas. Coins leading the way. Alright. We could have jumped on him, but... Alright, so far it's not bad. I'm not going to try to go for all the Yoshi coins or anything. Um, I'll point out things here and there. Man, them drums went hard. I like this song. And so far, it seems... Like it's just a lot of like right-leaning paths. A couple of gaps to jump over. Some Goombas. A feather in the first level. That can potentially be broken. If I wanted to now, I could just get up some speed and then fly through the whole level. Fly over the top of it. That's kind of broken to have in your first level. Uh, but, I mean, it's not bad. It's just veteran users could uh, misuse it to just skip over everything. I would probably have some other, like, there's a lot of these that are leading to the right. I would probably add a couple of them that are, like, jutting out to the left instead. What's down here? Oh, a little secret path. These used blocks, they, on the corners, there's a little bit of cutoff with the, ow, with the landmass. You could just use the upside down landmass. Um, or you can, if it's in, if it's not in Lunar Magic, you can make, you can easily make the tiles. And that's it. For the first level, not bad. There's a little bit of cutoff with those, with those, uh, brown used blocks. But, other than that, I would say, like, maybe have some, some left jutting platforms. Maybe a couple more Koopas. It wasn't bad, though. I didn't read the name of this level. We got bob -ombs. We got another feather right at the beginning. So again, that can be dangerous. There's a lot of cliffs now. And there's no... Uh... Oh boy, that's scary. You don't want coins leading down and then have a bottomless pit underneath it. Granted, I do have the cape, so that did help. But, uh, yeah, that could be dangerous. The player could easily die. Ugh. Now I don't have a feather. That was a good one. Waiting for that platform to fall down to get the uh, coin. But it makes a sense of urgency because there's a bottomless pit. Midway point. Hopefully that midway point spits you out here. I'm going to test it, because if it's on those platforms, that could be bad. Jagged Bomb Cliffs. Okay, that's the name of the level. Alright, that spits us out just before it. That's good. Because, yeah, you know, <laughs> I was expecting that the midway point wouldn't spit you out on the, uh, the falling lift. That would have been bad. 
So it's just bombs, right? Just bob bombs. I hear thunder outside. Does this lead? Yeah, it leads to a Yoshi coin. All right, fair enough. I'm not sure what else to say about this level. It's a lot of just empty cliffs and bombs parachuting down. What is that up there? Nothing? Interesting. I would maybe <sighs> make use of the 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 angled platforms on this level too. And again, I would have them like facing left and facing right. Just to add a little bit of variety to like the level geometry. The levels seem a little bit short too. Uh but again, it's it's only the second level. I didn't really notice any like uh things going on. I wanna go back to the first level. I didn't really mention it, but I did notice it. Yeah, okay. The 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 background tile set, the palette's kinda messed up. It's it's nothing game breaking, it's nothing major. Um it just looks weird. It's a, it's an easy fix too. It's an easy fix. You can just go to the palette for the background. Um and do a couple of changes. Turnbridge Tango. Uh turn bridges. Fireflower. Okay. See, I would This music is good. I didn't really comment on the song in the last level. Oh boy. This uh I would have done the fire flower. I would love to have a, uh, how am I going to get out of this situation? There we go. I would love <sighs> these Goombas. I would have, uh, done the fire flower for the first and second level and then have the feather for this level. That's what I would have done. Um, there's a lot of para paratrooping Goombas. I'm gonna forget that dragon coin. There's a lot of Goombas coming down. You gotta be careful with how many sprites you have, because if you have too many, it can cause sprites to uh, disappear. But they, like, they, they just visually disappear. They can still hit Mario, and that's not good. Like, you don't want that. Also, it's interesting to see that the Goombas do not interact with the turn bridges. I think it's because they're both technically sprites. So that makes it a little bit awkward for the spacing. Oh boy, okay. I'm glad that wasn't like a bottomless pit. There's not a whole lot going on though. It's mostly just like pits. And turn and the, the waiting for the bridges. Ugh. I would add a couple more things. Ugh. I'm not a big fan of the turn bridges. If there's one thing I hate more than turn bridges, it's springboards and like the spinny platforms from like Mario 3. Spring. Oh, good. Springboards. This is no fault of the creator. Ooh. This song sounds... familiar? What song is this? It's on the tip of my tongue. Holy crap. Oh, hello. Oh, that that's kind of weird. Again, these brown blocks cut off in the water. Cut off is kind of odd. And, I, okay, yeah. I would definitely take these brown blocks, these used coin blocks, and make them landmass. If there's n I don't see a P-switch, but if there was a P-switch, I'd be able to activate it, collect all these coins, and then the water would just be floating and it would look weird. I would just change it to the, the, the landmass. Um, what have we got down here? 
And again with these, I would change these to just regular land as well. They make... They make cut off with the... Uh, and Big Mario cannot fit in there. They make cut off with the water and with the land. Come on. That's very difficult for Big Mario. I gotta, like, match the drum button. This song is good, though. I will say... At least it's not like Donkey Kong Country music with like the with the improper note that uh, when you jump it causes the, the the beep glitch. I remember those days. Ugh. It's been I've been out of the Mario hack scene for about like ten years. I'm so bad at springboards. What is the point of those coins? Yeah, just because I don't like springboards doesn't mean I'm gonna give like any bad notes on the on the hack. That's just that's a skill issue on my part. Oh, I'm running out of time. What do we got? Oh, okay. Uh, is that a secret for Dragon Coin? I'm not gonna go for that. I'm not good enough with the springboards. If the creator of the hack is watching this, please tell me what the song is. Oof. Okay. Oh, a green turtle. This level has pretty good variety. Pretty good challenge, too. Oh. I'm not good at those kind of jumps. The the amount of springboards. For me, personally, it's, it's too much. But, I mean, again, that's... That's a skill issue on my part. Uh, I think it's fine. I think it. I think it's totally fine. There's a lot of jumping in this level, though. Ooh, but it's okay. There's a lot of gaps, but the coins are very well done. Goodbye, fire flower. I, I, I'm falling apart now. That's what happens when you do live commentary. I do get to listen to more of the song, though. Alright, let's see if we can get this... Yeah, please tell me what this song is. It's... It's gonna bother me not knowing. I'm probably being, like, really stupid right now. Like, it, it's so... It's so obvious. I'm not gonna use save states. Way back in the day, I used to save scum like crazy with save states. And, uh... I've, I've since gotten out of that habit, but again, I haven't really... Sat down and played Mario of any kind in a long time. Like I said, I've been out of the hacking scene for at least 10 years. So I have a lot of rust to shake off. I am liking this. <laughs> I am liking this challenge though. It's a bit much for me. It's a skill issue on my part. It, no fault of the creator. The level's not boring either. It's it's very good. It's just springboards are finicky. I never I never liked springboards. They're oh, they're so finicky I'm gonna wait here for a second I've just I've never been a fan all right I shouldn't have gone for that dragon coin I should have just took the end of the level when I had the chance 
That was what, level 4? I haven't seen... I didn't see any, like, tile errors in that level. Crimson Castle. Oh, boy. That is Crimson. What is this song? This is the first castle. Get to the end of... Get the... Get to the end to fight face-to-face -face with a certain foe. Okay. I was reading that weird. Oh, boy. We got the fire guys. I forget what they're called. Um, I really forget what they're called. Shows how much I know about Mario. This song... This fits for a castle. There's some coins up there. Oh, boy. Faster... Okay. Okay. We got slow turtles and fast turtles. That's good. The, the wire's a little bit cut off. I don't know how that would... How you could go about fixing that. Um. Oh. We gotta wait for these guys. I, I need... Oh, no. I would like... I'm guessing this is gonna be Iggy Koopa. I would love... A fire flower. Jump on Iggy Koopa when you have the higher ground to push him into lava and beat him at his own game. Yeah, Iggy's very easy. He's a first boss. If you have a fire flower, you can uh, just annihilate him. So the putting a fire flower there is very nice. What are we gonna do here? All right. Oh no. These fireballs I'm bad with them but it's a it it introduces a very nice challenge so what do we got going on over here then I'm assuming coins yeah just coins all right nice little bonus at the end that's good I can respect that. Ooh, and a, and a uh, extra mushroom. There we go. There's Iggy. Yeah, if you fireball him too, you can do it faster. I got lucky with that spin jump. Is that the last level? That castle was pretty good. It was short. It was only one room. I think castles are usually two rooms, and then the boss. So why did Iggy Koopa just have the one-star dragon ball on him anyway? I'm confused. I'm confused on that. Let's see what happens. We're just going off into the water. And we're off the screen. Alright, well, that's Mario Adventureland Demo. Link's gonna be in the description. Um, if you are watching Goldfeld, uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully, uh, the, the criticism and the, the positives and negatives are something that you were looking for. Uh, hopefully you don't think I was too harsh or anything. Um, if you continue this hack, I would love to play the continuations as you go along um it was fun i don't know if this is like a first hack or not but uh yeah it was a lot of fun i enjoyed uh keep at it i, I really want to see more um on a side note uh if you enjoyed the video remember always to like comment and subscribe I'm gonna try to put these Mario videos out like once or twice a week. Um, so yeah, until then, take care, have fun, be safe. I'll see you guys next time.